Hello and welcome. This episode will be the last part of this series. We are trying to reach a level that is above 187 here at the Einbeach Mine. The monsters here doesn't really pose much trouble as long as you have a wholly enchanted weapon and a gear that bypass defense. Using a plus 10 evil dragon armor together with malicious shadow set and two hunter flies boosts the chances of leeching HP with each attacks. Take the hunting mission if it is available. The rewards gives a huge amount of experience points. After finishing the mission here at Heights and Iron Bench, we proceed to the next location. Since we are now at level 190, the Abyss Lake mission is now available for us. We will go there later. Don't forget to use Cursed Water here at Odin's Temple 4. It is easier to hit the monsters here now, however, some of my attacks still miss. Upon completion, we get the rewards and proceed to Abyss Lake. Using cross impact here to defeat the monsters here quickly. Getting mobbed by the monsters here will result to instant trip back to save point, so be careful. As expected, Meteor Assault will miss because my deck stat is low. Knocked out again. Returned to town and brought some healing items. This is a difficult run. After completing the mission, we return to Hugel. After getting the rewards, we hunt at Odin's Temple. The clips from level 193 to 196 were corrupted, therefore we skip directly to the next day. The mission is available again. We are expected to reach level 199 after finishing the three missions that give huge rewards. Next is Odin's Temple. We are now able to hit the monsters here with Meteor Assault effortlessly. Thank you. 
upon completion. Get the reward and proceed to Abyss Lake. Using Meteor Assault here now since I increased my deck stat. However, healing potions is still a must because we are not using a gear that grants 100% chance to leech HP. will be switching to cross impact because I can't hit the mimics. Still need a few more experience points to reach a new level. Gonna head to Odin's Temple now. One more level to reach the goal. Decided to do the final run here at Abyss Lake. If you haven't already noticed, I was not using some battle manual buffs since the last part. That reason for that is I had no time to farm the required items to exchange for the buff. Good thing there is still an active experience modifier during this week, so it was still fast to level up. Total time spent in leveling from level 1 to 200 is about to 17 to 18 hours. Used a lot of healing consumables for this character. This was a fun run. I apologize for not being able to upload the parts of the series consistently. Work schedule is getting more demanding as December nears in. However, I still want to thank you for supporting. We'll continue to share and upload more Ragnarok journeys. So stay tuned.